What's up, guys? It's been a while since I've been on this side of the camera. But uh, last year, around this time in August, actually a year ago, I did a vlog that I never posted. Um, and it was called A Day in a Life. And basically, it was just a lot of going on that weekend for me. And I wanted to document it. Didn't feel like it was worth posting, but um, my friends keep asking me to post it and they keep bothering me and they're saying, post it, post it, post it, even after a year. And so I thought I'd post it. This is why this disclaimer's here. So I hope you enjoy the video. Peace. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Super cliche line for a YouTuber. <laughs> um, I haven't done a vlog here in a while, so I thought I'd take you on a day in the life, like uh, in my life actually, and uh, kind of show you, you know, the things that, that go on in my life. A lot of people ask me, you know, what do I do? What is it like to travel? What is it like to do conferences at camps and all that stuff? Um, I'm not much of a vlogger. I won't consider myself a vlogger, but because of the people that have asked, I thought I'd um, kind of take you on the road with me this weekend. It's kind of a busy weekend. Today, Friday the 13th. Uh, currently, right now, I'm about to drive up to Corrigan, Texas. Um, it's close to Lufkin. I was up in Lufkin a few weeks ago for Texas Youth Conference, and I got a citation. So I have to go to court. Doing that, and then from there, I'm driving to Huntsville, Texas. And we have a camp at my home church where I grew up. I'll be there tonight. And then tomorrow morning, I gotta be at the airport at 5.30, fly out at seven, and fly out to San Francisco, get there about nine, gonna be there for a live recording. I'm doing all the capture, the audio capture. So um, we do that, record all day, and then we have a red eye flight uh, at midnight, which is Sunday now. Fly back in around 5 a.m. here in Houston, close to 6 a.m. And then grab some food, come change, and go straight to rehearsal for church. So, I thought I'd take you on the journey this weekend, and uh, hope you guys enjoy this video. Also, life update. I just got a Ford Bronco, which I am super pumped about. And I just got it this week, so it's my first road trip with it. Uh, so, let's see how it goes. So, uh, as I was en route to Corrigan, I double checked my citation one more time and uh, found out I could pay online and all that good stuff. So, now I'm en route to uh, our camp. So, we're going to Huntsville, Texas to a camp called Carolina Creek. So, I am uh, currently en route there. Should be there in about was an hour and five minutes. Excuse me? Is this a showroom? Yeah, why? Okay. I'm vlogging this week. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What are you vlogging? A day in the life of, of my life. Of Luis? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's very boring. Yeah. Oh, the thing I need. What's up, everybody? What's up? My name's uh, Ulises. If you can hit me up on UOJEDA on the Square 51. Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on MySpace. Follow me on... Uh, what was that? Order? He said, follow me on MySpace. <laughs> MySpace? <laughs> This is how we do for youth camp, all right? Ready? <laughs> he brought the four-wheeler! Let's go! By the way, guys, this used to be my four-wheeler. I saw this alley. Let's take care of it. Hey, Ulises, you brought the four-wheeler. Let's go! Wow, isn't she beautiful? What a beauty. 
got some food when you're in the country I uh, tend to stop at Chicken Express it's actually one of my favorite spots to eat at so here we are we just finished eating Ulises yes, what was your name Xavier Xavier he's on my blog he's helping with us with setting up the sound and whatnot this week at the camp for oof oof What's up guys? So, service was over, it was great service. Service is over, we got some food after, hung out, chilled. It's 106, it's an hour and 27 minutes away, so it says I'm gonna be home about 2.33. We're taking off, we're meeting up at five at the church uh, with Shannon, Shannon's over this, uh, Jeremiah's going, and then we have a new intern from Louisiana, West Monroe, his name is Kel, and he's going with us too. And then I have my buddy David Zuniga. He's actually from Florida, but he's at Stockton. He's in Stockton for COC for school and stuff. So he's going to be our fourth, fourth shooter. So we're going to meet up at 5 a.m. at the church. We're all going to ride together to the airport. I'm a shuttle, and then after that, um, we're going to um, our flight takes off at 7:20. So here we go. got home it's 243 I don't know how I made it home I'm dying to sleep I'm tired <sighs> I was gonna go to the church pack up so just so you guys know I'm running sound for so tomorrow we're flying out to San Francisco um, we're doing a live recording for a guy named Mark Andrus and uh, I'm taking some P16, some ethernet cables, and things like that. So I have a few in my truck, and then I have two in my office. But I gotta put them in my Pelican case. And uh, that's what I'll be taking tomorrow, well, in a few hours. I was gonna do that right now, but I'm so tired that I'm just gonna do it in the morning, well, in a few hours. Um, the guys are gonna be here. Everybody's meeting here. And, an hour and 17 minutes. I mean, I'm sorry, in two hours and 17 minutes. So, I'm gonna try to get some sleep and um, pick this up back up in a few. Weeks. All right, it's um, Saturday, the what, what's today's date? Uh, 14th. The 14th, and we are all in the car. Um, on our way to the airport. Today's a long day. We got um, we got a flight to catch that takes off at 7:20. Land around nine, two-hour difference uh, in San Francisco, and then I really don't know what we have planned today. Oh, brother, we got a lot planned. Uh, what is it? Lewis is vlogging and driving. By the way, don't let you got to put a disclaimer out there that says. Yeah. Disclaimer. This is professional. Don't try this at home. Professionals uh, are doing this. Okay, don't try this at home. <laughs> so, um, we're doing, like I said earlier, doing a live recording for a guy named Mark Yandres. And so, uh, really don't know what to expect. Don't know what time we'll start. Um, Hopefully 2 p.m. Scheduled to be there by 2. 
Hopefully we can start rolling with vocals and everything, knock it out. Sweet. And uh, I think it's four songs, and we're going to track them all the way through until we're done. Um, and then we have a red eye that takes off at midnight Sunday morning. We land in Houston at 6 a.m. because of the two-hour difference. And then we'll probably get food and then get ready for service. I got sound check at 8.15. So, yeah. <laughs> we have no delays today. Today has to be perfect. In Jesus' name. <laughs> also, I'm running on an hour and a half of sleep, so let's see how this goes. All right, we just got to uh, the uh, park in Fast Park, which is where I parked my vehicle. Um, I'm just waiting for our shuttle to get here. Um, yeah, we're all packed light. We're not staying over there to sleep or anything like that. So we literally just packed gear. So we all got Pelican cases and whatnot. So we got my case, I got P16s. Ethernet cables. We got Shannon. Okay. And then we got all the camera gear and Easy Rigs, all Pelicans. Got Jeremiah. How you feeling, bro? I'm feeling good. Yeah? Yeah. You don't look good. And then we got Kale. What's up? This is his first uh, gig with us. This is only my third time flying. What? So <laughs> That's crazy. What? I did not know that. He's scared or what? Are you scared? Nah, I'm good. Oh, yeah. good. That's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> we'll find out. They like randomly select him through TSA or something. No. Like, Bro, yes. <laughs> Thank you, sir. What's coming up? Uh, C. You know what I thought about, Jeremiah? What did you think about, man? Those, uh,. I was thinking about what recording format we'll use, but the 6Ks we brought only record raw and 4K. Oh, wow. So. Yeah. <laughs> this airport's jam packed. Let's hope we make it. Gang, right. gang. Stressing. Yo, talk about pre check. Uh, free check, you gotta get it. Uh, it's only like a hundred bucks a month. Uh, a month? I'm sorry. <laughs> That's music, man. A hundred dollars a year, or for five years? Five, five years, years, yep. You gotta get TSA free check, because if you do, then you can make flights when you're a little bit late, unlike Jeremiah and <laughs> Kale, because they're going through regular. <laughs> so this is the guy who's got group five boarding. Boarding, boarding at one, yeah, that's me. <laughs> boarding with first class, that's me. Let's go, all right, hey guys. First part of the day, success, all right? We made Good. it, first flight. Check one of five or four or whatever. <clears throat> or something like that. Could have been in the back too. I, I could have been him, but God. But God. <laughs> seen that it's crazy man we're out here in the bay area this this city's crazy <laughs> it's the city i'm telling you it's crazy 
Yeah, that's one word to put it. You've never been to the city. <laughs> it's my second time. <laughs> Hey, welcome. Hey, how's your seat? It was, it was fine. I lost my AirPod. No! I I lost, it. Oh. I it. Yeah. Lewis likes dropping that Bay Area tag. He's like, yeah. You're in the Bay Area. Bay Area, dog. Yeah. I feel like I have to wear my mask like outside and everything here. I'm not. Oh, I won't. You can take me to jail, bro. Yeah, we're from Texas. We don't know any better. <laughs> Sometimes when I travel out of Texas, like far places like California or something, I feel like I'm just in a different country. I feel you. I yeah. feel you, bro. I, never, I feel you. It's so weird. Like, I, do I need my passport to go there? <laughs> my vaccination card. Sheesh! Our rental card. We got the rover. Let's go. That's crazy. Never mind. We're just driving this clown car. <laughs> uh, All right. So we're in this uh, Colorado. Oh, yeah. AKA okay, clown car. What is it? The clown car. Clown car. Okay. Very good. In this clown car, and we're about to head out. Rover, but Say that one more time, brother. Could have had the rover, but I don't know what Shannon was thinking. Dang, bro, you gonna let him talk to you like that? Disrespect you, bro? Get Shit. out of here, bro. It's crazy. I will leave you in San Francisco. Leave that fool, dog. I just had it in reverse. Yeah, you almost hit that thing, bro. Imagine. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't want to imagine, bro. Good thing I got insurance. Thank you so much. You don't have Yelp, or y'all even real? Bye. Bye. Ciao, ciao. So we went to Mark Crowder's live recording, and. uh Went with Shannon, and he got a Colorado too. So here we are again in the Colorado. I'm gonna have to get Colorados everywhere we go. Yeah. Except I when I go to Colorado, I gotta get <laughs> <laughs> then I have to get something else. Look at all this gear. We're right here at the Rock Church. My boy David. What's up? Go, dog. Hello. How are you, bro? Yeah, good yeah, to see you. Good to see you too. How are you, bro? Good. Excited for yeah. what's gonna happen, bro. Why are you excited? Cause I'm excited. I'm a fuck. We gotta get all this gear down. Here, let's, yeah, let's start with this. So we rented a uh, Dana Dolly. So that's what these poles are for and stuff. And there's a Dana Dolly. We're gonna unload this and start getting ready. Welcome home. Wow. Oh. We out here. Gang, 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 gang. All right, so we're here, the recording. And I'm capturing audio. So I got an x 2 we had to set up. We went to Logic, my computer. And um, we got keys. Uh, there's an organ player, but uh, they're overdubbing that later. So we're not tracking that tonight. Uh, bass, drums. And then vocals will be tracked later as well. And there's all the stuff for the video. There's Dana Dolly there. So, we got David. Came through. This yeah, homie's yeah. trying to sell his uh, lens. Or trying to trade it for my, for my zoom. I can't go back to Stockton without a zoom lens. Bro, this lens is fire. David, he's running the Dana Dolly. He's acting like he's doing something. He ain't doing jack squat. 
He ain't doing jack squat. We got Gabby. All right, we just wrapped up, packing up. Um, six seventeen currently here, and um, we got a few hours before we have to fly out. So probably gonna grab food, hit the Golden Gate Bridge, chill a little bit before we have to go back. So these dudes smashed. Frio. Bro, I got no more fingers, bro. Bro. Yo, it's a vibe, though. It's a vibe, though. <laughs> after, after, what happened? After going to the bridge, over there, back, and over there, back, we finally <laughs> got a parking, homie. A parking, that's it. Hey, hoy, la vida. Took us an hour to find some parking, a parking spot. Exactly an hour. An hour. We literally went back. To the Golden, Golden Gate Bridge. Back we, we went, we came back. Watch out, bro. Hey, go. Hey. We almost got ran over. That's fire. Anyways, um, <laughs> we got, where, where is it at? This way, this way. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm just walking. I don't know either. Anyways, we went Golden Gate Bridge. Golden Gate Bridge. Golden we e came bridge. back. <laughs> and then we went back. And then we came back. And then we finally find a parking spot. Finally, bro. Hey, you know what? God, it's still good, man. Finally, going back to the bridge and back. We finally got a party. <laughs> back to the bridge and back. Bro, they don't have sweet tea here. <laughs> bro, what you think? This ain't, this ain't the South, bro? Uh, no, I know. I've seen this. We he in said, the Wild West, boy. He said, you got sweet tea? He's like, ooh, what's sweet tea? I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> I don't like homemade ketchup. Yeah, I know. That's why when he brought it out, you were like, what is that? Yeah. I'm going to cry. Are you? Bro, this burger looks good. Fire! Yeah, the fries are bomb. So for y'all that thought it was fun, it was all fun and games and all that stuff. It can be, but I wanted to show y'all and uh, let y'all see how. This can be challenging, it's fun, but it's tiring. There's a lot of no sleep, and uh, I haven't slept in a while, so.
Take them on one trip, come on. Look, 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 look. Here's a line, this is Jeremiah. Is it? Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> we got sound check at 8.15, we land at 6, gotta get our luggage, shuttle back to the parking lot, and then change all that stuff, go straight to rehearsal, maybe get some breakfast tacos if we have time, we'll find out, so it's been fun though, and tiring, so it's a two hour, uh, two hour difference, so we leave here at 12, it's actually 2 a.m. and it'll be 2 a.m. in Houston. We we'll leave here at 12.15, we land at 6 a.m. It's a four hour flight, so. Fun times ahead. For the kingdom. What's up guys so this is team no sleep it's uh august the 15th sunday morning flew back in got in at six by the time we got back shuttled to the car and all that stuff it was about 7 a.m grabbed some food got back to the church set the cameras up i didn't shannon and the guys did i kind of did some other stuff turn on the lights get everything ready and uh went home shower changed and now it is 8.10 and uh, right on right on time, grabbing my in-ears getting set up for rehearsal uh, this morning. Sound check starts at, well, rehearsal starts at 8.15, singers come in at 8.30. Um, I'm going to hit it all day and then uh, we got, I got one more service tonight at 6 o'clock at my home church, so um, yeah, team no sleep. We got Jason, he's a front of the house guy. If you're taking them, um, can you get one without the mask? Bro? Yeah, yeah, Thank you. Yeah, there you go. They want to see my mug. <laughs> we got EJ, he's our lighting director. He's a beast. Jeremiah's getting a little taste of what it is to get a red eye and fly in and come straight to church. Got David, he's got his morning face on. Look at that morning face. Sheesh. Sickle morning face. Haley. Sick. Sound check. David still got that morning face on. Sheesh. Look at that morning face. And they got Brett back there. He's on percussion. We got Jeremiah. He's learning today what it is to take a red eye flight and come straight to church. He's on guitar too. We got my dude Ben on the electric one. I'm gonna focus on him. Whatever. Ben, y'all know Ben. Brandon. Alright, so we just finished service. It's 11.53. I'm tired. I'm dying, actually. Um, it was great service. Pastor preached a great word. And uh, 
So now I'm probably going to take a nap for an hour or something. Grab some food. And then I got to be at my home church tonight. So I'll do that. Uh, and then my weekend will officially be over. So it's been crazy. Um, but I just kind of wanted to take you guys on this journey. Show y'all. You know, I have a lot of people ask me, what is it like? You know, how do you get to do these things? What, you know, what does your life look like when you do these things? And, you know, just want people to see that it's not always the easiest thing. Um, it's tiring. Um, but for me, it's rewarding. I mean, it's ministry. Uh, and at the same time, I love what I do and I enjoy it. And I have so much fun doing it and doing it with people I love. And so it's great, you know, so. Uh, but sometimes it's like this. Last week it was, you know, we went full, full the whole weekend for uh, a conference called Identidad Apostolica. And that took a lot of energy for me. And then next week um, I'm traveling again. And then the following week I have another conference. Two weeks from that uh, I'm in Chicago. So it's always, there's always something. But like I said, I just kind of wanted to show y'all. Uh, what it looks like, you know, and show you all that, yeah, I mean, it's fun, we can, you know, we have a great time, we enjoy it, um, it's exhausting, but it's also rewarding to get to, you know, spread the gospel of Jesus Christ through our ministry and my ministry and the things that I, you know, God's given me, and so it's just a blessing to be able to bless other people and at the same time be blessed, so um, we still got a little bit to go show y'all a little bit you know i have rehearsal at 4 45 4 50 like sound check kind of thing in my home church central that's where i grew up uh, I, I i help out as much as i can on sunday nights so i played last sunday i'm playing this sunday tonight as well uh, most of the time i'll play as well at or at royalwood spanish church called iglesia de royalwood they start at two so if I was playing, like last week, I played all three services. So right after the, my English service, I would go grab like drive through food or something like that. Come back at 12.30, we have rehearsal until 1.30. Service starts at two, we're out by four. From here, I head out to Central, sound check at 4, 4.45, and then church at six. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog so far. I know it's long, it's lengthy, but people have been asking for it, and I thought I'd, you know, I thought I'd make this vlog. I, mean, I don't, I don't feel like I'm a, that great of a vlogger. Uh, I don't feel like I'm good at it, but you know, if you guys are enjoying it, I'll, I'm not good at it, but I hope you guys have enjoyed it. So. a wrap Larturin he could barely hold up today he, he's been singing all week at camp Sick or Julie. I just got this you like my lip singing I got this he just didn't want to sing it I got yeah 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 <laughs> hold on we play drums today don't bring my don't bring my, my phone Lauro Jr. Lauro 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 the third <laughs> preached today and short Brian preached today you know he has to be extra on the whole yeah, demonstration. Pit. He brought a yeah. barbecue pit, but he didn't bring the platform. But he did not bring the brisket. So, <laughs> what's up, guys? Today's August the sixteenth. Yeah, the sixteenth. Um, I know it's been kind of a long vlog, and if you made it up to this point, I really appreciate you sticking with me. Um, I totally forgot to close out the vlog last night. Uh, after church, we went to grab some food. After church, we went to go grab some food and uh, came home and crashed. It's been a long weekend. But um, I just kind of wanted to show you guys, you know, what it is to, 
you know what my weekends look like what my days look like when i'm traveling when i'm playing when i'm doing other ministry uh, things um like i said a few of you have asked about a vlog what do i do um, and now i'm on my way to work I work at the church royalwood church repping um and i worked there full time and uh so yeah i mean that's this was my this is what my weekends look like we're headed back again this weekend and the following weekend um and so i'm not complaining i love it it's it's so much fun it's rewarding um i love to travel love to meet new people love to meet new places um and just interact with, with different people it's such a blessing um, and I'm grateful for the opportunities and the doors that God opens. Um, it's been fun. And like I said, I'm extremely grateful. But at the same time, I wanted to show you guys. It's not always fun. You know, there's the traveling part and trying to get back in time. And and even though I love to travel, but red eyes are not fun. You know, we're leaving the West Coast at midnight. We're losing two hours getting here to Houston. We land at six. And that's your whole night already you know no sleep by the time you get your baggage get shuttled back to your car at seven o'clock you know so it's like things like that that you know honestly they're not fun but it's part of the job and it's part about it's part of you know getting back to church like i said um not just because i work for the church i have to be back but i don't like missing sundays and i don't ever want to make it I don't ever want to make it the norm to miss Sundays, even if I'm not serving or if I'm not playing. So that's my like standard if I go anywhere, unless, you know, it's something different, something bigger, or it requires me to be out on a Sunday or been asked to go minister somewhere on a Sunday, um, you know, then I run that by my pastor. But for the most part, I try not to, to miss Sundays. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Like I said, I'm, I don't do much vlogs, so. Uh, I really hope this is uh, beneficial to somebody, and I hope, you know, I'm able to share some perspective of, you know, this whole thing. So, I appreciate you sticking with me. Subscribe, like the video, and I really know how to close this out. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.